hate it, folks, and uh, welcome back, I guess. This is going to be a therapy-inducing episode. Get that juice all on the cutting board. That's a big tongue. I asked them to g give me give me the most moderately sized tongue you got, and boy, did they swing for the fences on this one. There's a whole lot of tongue going on here. Can, can you hear that? It's like a cat's tongue. It looks like the bottom of my foot. It certainly brings a lot of fear to mind. Uh, there's so much to say with so little vocabulary. Did you know that you have to peel tongue? Why, why don't you say we get we get started on this and, and boil ourselves some tongue so that we can peel it? Well, I, I've been down here for like 20 minutes getting this water to boil. I don't think it's going to happen. We're moving to upstairs to boil this tongue. Here we go! Uh-oh. Oh, it barely fits. Ignore that for three hours. Let's check this out after one hour. Oh my god. We'll be checking in in another hour. All right, we're checking in at two hours. Good Lord. Hey, what's for dinner? All right. And that's three hours. Let's get this tongue out of there. These are the wrong tongues for this. Here we go. And kerplunk. Let's peel this thing. God, did you did you ever imagine? All right, well that's 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 good enough. Well, there it is. We we kind of messed up the end here, but that's you know who cares? It's going it's going in the grinder anyway. But you know just just for giggles, let's uh, just just for giggles, let's you know let's see what it looks like on the inside. Uh, there it is, very tongue-like in nature. Yep, that's tongue. It's very good. It, it almost tastes like pot roast. But anyway, let's chuck it in the grinder and, and turn it into sausage. Yep. Well, that's, that's, that's... That's going to make quite a bit of sausage. We're going to hit it with some salt, pepper, onion powder, and garlic powder. We'll get some more room here. This may turn out to be a good sausage after all. That's looking not so terrible. Well, you can't tell by the way I use my walk. I'm a sausage man. No time to talk. In three, two... Let sausage. And there it is. There's there's our sausage. With special thanks to today's. Well, that's kind of lopsided. But with special thanks to today's Mark Boxalo box artist, this guy. This Will It Blow is brought to you by HelloFresh. Looking to heat up your summertime suppers? Well, then look no further than HelloFresh. Offering 30 dinner recipes to choose from each and every week. That's more choices than any other meal kit. It's as hot as a frying pan out there. So why not beat the heat by staying inside in your nice air-conditioned kitchen? And while you're there, discover seasonal summer recipes like chicken sausage stuffed peppers, Tuscan spiced shrimp, or what I'm making today. This Southwest Beef Cavatappi. Going on vacation? Update your delivery address and enjoy HelloFresh at your vacation destination with just a click. Planes are flexible, so they work with your changing schedule. Got a swimsuit you're still trying to fit in? HelloFresh offers veggie, pescatarian, and fit and wholesome meals to make it easy to stick to your goals. And since HelloFresh meals can be prepared and cooked in just 30 minutes, you can spend more time sweating outside instead of sweating in the kitchen. Unless you got that AC turned up on full blast. Go to HelloFresh.com and use code SAUSAGE16 for up to 16 free meals and three surprise gifts. That's HelloFresh.com. Code SAUSAGE16 for up to 16 free meals and three surprise gifts. So will it blow? Oh, there was a...
was a solid hit right in the center. Not a, not a whole lot of spread, but there was a, a lot of accuracy. So I'm going to have to give that, will it blow? Three Mark Ruffalos! Here we go! Oh, we got a, we got a burst. So much for this pan being non-stick. You cruddy pan. We're gonna get it out of the pan before it sticks again. Let's open this up and see how we did. It looks like shredded, what? It looks like shredded pork. Extra long, that's how I like them. Okay, here we go. Taste-wise, this sausage is, is great. It, it's got a great flavor. All, all of our problems are, are because of this casing here not wanting to crisp up. This is this is some gummy, and it's 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 chewy. I, I, it, it, you can't even cut it. That's how bad the casing is. Had the casing have held up, I would have easily given this sausage a 5 out of 5. However, the casing is so bad that I'm dropping it not one, but two points, so I'm gonna have to give this sausage here a three out of five. Bop, 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 bop. It's probably better just to enjoy the 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 the, the tongue without the the casing on it. Let, let's let's see how it is with just the uh, with just the tongue. The the tongue on its own is a five out of five.